Hello everyone, this is Brendan from Sherman's Martial Arts. This is going to be the first online video lesson I post while our school is closed for coronavirus. These lessons will focus mostly on techniques and forms, things we can practice at home without a partner. If there's anything specific you would like to see in future video lessons, please write me a comment or an email and I will be sure to cover them. Today's lesson will focus on stretching and basic technique drills we can do with both our hands and our feet. So we will start with stretching. So these are going to be the simple stretches that we should do every time before we practice. So in the future, I'll be doing these off camera. If you're following these lessons, make sure you're stretched before you go in. Spread your feet shoulder width apart, both hands down to one side, 10 seconds. Other side. Center splits. Hands in front of you with your weight on your upper body, pinky toes up in the air. One knee to the ground, turn your upper body and the other side, one hand on either side of this front leg. Other side. Sit back, put one foot along the side of your other leg, both hands down to your toes. Those of you who are very flexible can try and get your forehead to your knee or down to the ground. And butterflies, bottoms of your feet together, hand grabbing your ankles, pulling them in, elbows, push your knees down to the ground, hold your upper body. With stretching done, now we can move on to our techniques practice. Next, we're going to go through a series of eight techniques in our horse stance. I'm going to show it two times fast and then two times slow. Please try to follow along with me and practice until you're able to do the full series of eight without making a mistake. For our horse stance, we want our feet spread twice the width of our shoulders with our knees bent, toes facing forward and back up straight, our hands are chambered at our belt. Techniques are going to be one, left low block, two, right low block, three, left middle block, four, right middle block, five, left high block, six, right high block, seven, left punch, eight, right punch. Two times slow, two times fast. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, 
eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, finally for today, we're going to show two different kicking drills. One using a chair to help you balance, and one without. So, for using the chair, you put your hand on the back of the chair. Let me move this. Hand on the back of the chair, body facing forward, and we're going to go through all three parts of the kick one at a time. The chamber, the strike, and then the re-chamber. So, for round kick, one, chamber, two, strike, three, re-chamber, and down. And for each kick, you want to do five times on each side. For our round kick, for our side kick. And finally, for our snap kick, we need to turn away. five times on each side with the chair is very good practice for our kicks. If you want to do the harder version, standing up will be in fighting stance and go on a count of three for each part of the kick. So for a snap kick, it would be one, two, three into the chamber, one, two, three into the extension, one, two, three into the re-chamber. For round kick, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Side kick, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. And again, practice five on each side with each kick. Okay, that is going to be it for today's lesson. Thank you for watching. I hope you follow along in future lessons that I post. If you have pictures or videos of you practicing at home, please send them to my email. I would really love to see them. Thank you. See you next time.